Edward Sotomayor, Jr., age 34. Stanley Almodova III, age 23. Luis Omar Ocasio Capo, age 20. Juan Ramon Guerrero, age 22. Eric Ivan Ortiz Rivera, age 36. Peter O. Gonzalez Cruz, age 22. Luis S. Vielma, age 22. Kimberly Morris, age 37. Kimberly was a bouncer at the Pulse nightclub. I saw the vigils happening uh, around the country and around the world, um, and I didn't think there was anything nearby. Uh, I worked at Comfy uh, 516, and in the last two years I've seen what a, a phenomenal community that Oldbridge is. Uh, we have uh, a, you know, a, a very tight-knit group, um, so I thought that we could show Orlando uh, and the rest of New Jersey how we feel about the tragedy. Daryl Roman Burt II, age 29. Dionka Deidre Drayton, age 32. Alejandro Barrios Martinez, age 21. Anthony Luis Loriano Disla, age 25. Jean Carlos Mendez Perez, age 35, and his longtime partner, Luis Daniel Wilson Leon, age 37. I realize that that's how we counter hate, is by educating, and educating our youth to go forward and be the change agents that we need, not only here in Old Bridge, but in the United States and beyond. If we start giving out more love and getting that back, and our students do that as they move on through Old Bridge High School and into the world, we're making a better place. Frankie Jimmy De Jesus Velasquez, age 50. Amanda Alvia, age 25. Martin Benitez Torres, age 33. Mercedes Marisol Flores, age 26. Xavier Emmanuel Serrano Rosado, age 35. Gilberto Ramon Silva Menendez, age 25. Simon Adrian Carrillo Fernandez, age 31. And his partner, Oscar A. Aracina Montero, age 26. As gays, we are aware of the loss of integrity we suffer due to pressures of a larger society. We often feel forced into a dishonest presentation of ourselves, to ourselves, and to others. We among us who feel we must pretend to be something we are not, and we who feel we must be alienated from our spiritual tradition and community to win larger acceptance, both are victims of a, death, of a theft of identity and integrity committed by the sexual or religious majority. Creator of the universe, we ask that our hiding draw to an end and that we no longer feel we have to pretend, to promise falsely, to renounce ourselves, and that our fullest creative expression as who we are be among the blessing you bestow upon us. Amen. Enrique. L. Rios, Jr., age 25. Miguel Angel Honorato, age 30. Javier Jorge Reyes, age 40. Joel Ryan Paniagua, age 32. Jason Benjamin jo Josafat, age 19. Corey James Connell, age 21. Juan P. Rivera Velasquez, age 37. Luis Daniel Condi, 
age 39. Shane Evan Tomlinson, age 33. Juan Chavez Martinez, age 25. Uh, thank you everyone. And um, I'm so glad the speakers had the opportunity to come before me because I've been thinking about this um, for a while uh, since I seen it on TV and was glued uh, to the television. And I couldn't think of anything to say except that this hatred that we talk about um, is no stranger to Overage. It visited here less than four years ago. And I can tell you that what you do here tonight, what you do here tonight gathering and like these candles helps. I've seen it as an eyewitness to the families of the victims here in Overage. You made the difference in their lives moving forward. And in Florida, when they see these pictures, you're going to help. You're going to help the families move forward, which in our country they must. Unfortunately, right now they probably don't think they can move forward. It's going to help those families in Florida move forward. So thank our community. I can't tell you how proud I am to stand here as your mayor. Um, the Oldbridge community, as David said, is, is outstanding. And now Orlando joins the list that Oldbridge is on with Columbine, with Newtown, now Oldbridge, now Orlando. So that list seems to be growing uh, in our society, and we have to do something to change it. We have to change that direction. So again, thank you. Uh, keep the victims in your prayers, and most of all, the families. That's what we're here for tonight, the families. Thank you. Harold Arthur Wright, age 31. Leroy Valentin Fernandez, age 25. Tevin Eugene Crosby, age 25. Jonathan Antonio Camuy Viga, age 24. Jean C. Nives Rodriguez, age 27. Rodolfo Ayala Ayala, age 33. Yilmeri Rodriguez Sullivan, age 24. Christopher Andrew Lenonen, age 32. Angel L. Candelario Padro, age 28. Frank Hernandez, age 25. Paul Terrell Henry, age 41. Antonio Devon Brown, age 29. A captain in the army who, who served in Kuwait for 11 months in 2010 and 2011. I just hope that, that people can stop teaching ignorance and hatred, whether it's for religious purposes or selfish purposes, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, you know, we, we all have to live in this life, we all have to go through the same stuff, uh, and none of us are any better or worse than the person standing next to us. And judging people because of who their heart wants and who they sleep with, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, so for me, uh, you know, it, it's a very simple solution. Some people like men, some people like women, some people like both. End of story. It's, it's, it should be that simple. Uh, and if it was, there'd be a lot of kids that didn't commit suicide. There'd be a lot of kids that weren't thrown out of their house. There'd be a lot of less hate crimes that we were taught from birth that it's not a negative thing to be to, to love the same sex. Uh, you know, it's positive, it's love, and that's where it should stem from. Christopher Joseph. Santelles, age 24. Geraldo A. Ortiz Jimenez, age 25. Akira Monet Murray, age 18. Akira turned 18 in January. She graduated third in her class from a prep school in Philadelphia, and to celebrate, she, her parents, and her four-year-old sister drove to Florida for vacation. Her parents dropped her off at Pulse nightclub at 11.30 p.m. Saturday night. At 2 a.m. she called her mother saying she was shot and losing a lot of blood. They never spoke again. Eddie Hamoldroy Justice, age 30. Eddie was trapped in the bathroom during the sh shooting, so he texted his mother. Mommy, I love you, he said. In club, they shooting. His mother, Mina Justice, called her son but he didn't answer. You okay? She texted back. 
Trapped in bathroom, he texted. Pulse, downtown, call police, I'm going to die. Brenda Lee Marquez McCool, 49. Brenda was a mother of 11 children. She was killed protecting the son she had went to Pulse nightclub to dance with. Isaiah Henderson, who witnessed his mother beat two rounds of cancer, watched her get shot next to him and die on the floor. Peace to the victims and all of their families. If you could please raise your candles high in the sky and bow your heads in silence. Let our love reach the heavens and our spirit and light heal from our hearts to theirs. <laughs>